I got a hit from the device you put on Frank Pagani's car, which means he's back in town. <laughs> bet he's pretty excited to make your acquaintance. I bet he is. <laughs> Signal's clean so you can take it from here. Just use the tracker I gave you. Catch you later. Looks like the place. Working for Marcano used to be a life a gig. My daddy, my uncles. Sure, they saw some action, but they always came out whole. What's your point, kid? Just feels like I missed out on the best times. The golden age. Don't fool yourself. Golden age still got a lot of folks dead. One way or another. You see Frank when he drove up? <laughs> Old bastard looked like his age 20 years. Between Castro, the coon, and the 50 G's of bad paper inside? I can kind of see why. Yeah. <laughs> Close your goddamn mouth and open your fucking ears. What we got ain't money, it's toilet paper. So unless you got the shits from your mama's... Ain't leaving you alone, Mr. Pagani. No telling what that nigga's gonna do next. He's already destroyed everything. He wants me, let him come. I'll get you boy and get out of here. I got no doubt Fish is cooking up a pot of crawfish for both of you. You sure? Go. I got Davis and his little old automatic. We'll be fine. We got a bumper for this asshole. I'm gonna take my time with you. Jesus. Jesus Christ. Go! Now, Frank! No one can keep up with those wheels! There'll be nothing left to get a battery. Here, over here. You can. Let's see if you really yeah. ready. Oh. Your time is up, motherfucker. Let's see if you still got skills, Frank. God damn, Sal. This is all he's fucking doing. Got his head so far up his own ass. Mr. Pagani, you can't be talking like that about Mr. Marcano. Listen here, kid. My daddy robbed banks for 20 years. Taught me two things. You never snitch, and you stay loyal. What's that?
Looks like the place. Working for Marcano used to be a life a gig. My daddy. Sure, they saw some action, but they always came out whole. What's your point, kid? Just... You got me. You see Frank when he drove up? <laughs> Old bastard looks like his age 20 years. Between Castro, the coon, and the 50 G's of bad paper inside, I can kind of see why. Listen here, asshole. You close your goddamn mouth and open your fucking ears. What we got ain't money, it's toilet paper. <laughs> If he wants me, to let him come. Today, I'll get your boy and get out of here. I got no doubt Trisha's cooking up a pot of crawfish for both of you. He, he is true. So, I got Davis and his little automatic. We'll be fine. Hang tight.
Oh, hey there, pal. How are you? I'm done with Frank Pagani. Poor bastard's not gonna be running anything through Tickfall Harbor again. It's our territory now. Took care of securing this part of the city for you. The boys are looking forward to making their sales at home as soon as possible. Didn't even know you were working that part of the city, lad. Hope you had fun. We're on a good run here, Lincoln. I see no reason anything should change. Now, not using my guys to lock down a district makes it real fucking messy if you want us to run shit, but hell, you pay me to clean up the mess. You know I'm the only one who will really have your back. I get it. You gotta consider all your options. A nation once again. A nation once again. Give me the key. You give this to me, my Connor's gonna shit himself. The Haitians will run this part of the city. Look at you staying true to the holler. Impact of this kind of change is gonna be felt across the city. Are we done here? I got a whore named Sadie and a bottle of Shane waiting. Better luck next time, I guess. We'll talk later. Get on out of here.